Oh, this looks interesting. What's up, everyone? My name is Swift Edge, and welcome to Don't Trust, a game where we play as a child who is just at home, I believe by ourselves. We downloaded a new game on our phone, and we started playing it, and something weird is happening. And this game actually is focused on the fact that every choice we make results in a different ending, and there are three. Apparently there's good, bad, and an Easter egg ending. I have no idea when it comes to Easter egg based endings how you get it. I'm watching that phone percentage die, so I am just going to go ahead and start this game so the percentage doesn't end in a bad manner. Whoop. Whoop. Why is it already at 95%? Don't trust the game. I don't trust the game already. Welcome. After finishing a task, remember to turn to return into a starting point in order to receive next next quest. Good luck. Objective: Eat a cookie located in the kitchen. Why? Why do I? Why is my phone telling me what I need to do already as day-to-day -day living? I want to eat a cookie. I'll eat a cookie. Okay. Life begins after coffee. <laughs> You are 14. You don't need to worry about having coffee. Hello, Jesus. I... What is making that noise? Oh, it's the fans. Thank God. I thought there was a monster on the other side of my door ready to pounce. Do I live in Nevada? Arizona? I live somewhere where there's a bit of a desert. I've been re-watching the old CSI crime scene investigation show and man, <laughs> watching that back. Oh, Lee. Nevada's an interesting place. Don't think I'd ever really want to go and visit Las Vegas. Amount of crimes that keep on happening there, even outside of re fiction. Like, mm-mm. Why is... Why is the... Why is... Why is... Why is the drawer open with a knife? Can I... Can I not? Can I... Can I not have that just open there. Why is the cookie sitting right there? I'm a little worried. What's my next objective? Can I... Okay, F is to put away the phone. I thought maybe I'd have a flashlight. I... I... I did it. I ate the cookie. I put my hand in the cookie jar. What's my next task? Are you going to tell me? God, that slams down hard, huh, doesn't it? Congratulations, you receive 100 points of experience. Put toys into the toy box. Is this my mother texting me? Is this my mother texting me saying, hey, I need to do some chores. You could have a cookie. Good lord, what's happening here? How old am I, by the way? Do I have younger siblings? Oh my god, I can drag and drop. I love it. I love it so much. If it just disappeared, that would be weird, but I, I I like this. Put the bucket in there. Any more toys? Any of my room? Nope. Congratulations, you leveled up. Why? Why is my door closing repeatedly? Can I ask that question? This is a horror game, dude. I have many questions. Like, what the fudge is in my house? Do I want to turn on the TV? Nope, 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 never mind. Something could come out of the TV. I don't want to. I don't want to do it. I don't trust the game. Funnily enough, can I take the knife? I'm going to take the knife and I'm going to put it in my room. Ignorance is always undesirable. Every player needs a good weapon. Put a kitchen knife into the toy box. <laughs> No. Why would I remove the knife from where it needs to be, which is with me? <laughs> I'm gonna break the rule. I'm putting that in there. How about that? Huh? What if I do that instead? What's gonna happen? Pathetic. I did not expect for you, from you to be such a noob. It is so quiet in here. Music perfectly intensifies the experience. Turn on the radio. I freaking swear to God, if one of these times I open the door and some... That's what I'm waiting for. Something's gonna be on the other side of the door. And I hate it. I, I hate the anticipation. Reality is often disappointing. Thanos? 
Why is Thanos on my radio? <laughs> I didn't turn on the TV, but I did turn on the radio. What's gonna happen? There's no turning back. Where's my knife? Where's my knife? Where's my knife? Where's my knife? What? What happened? For mama, people say that a boy carrying a toy box was seen near the river. Please answer me. Where are you? I'm really worried. Mama, no. Mama, no. I think I did something bad. You've reached the bad ending. Thank you for playing. Don't trust prototype. Oh, well, this is a prototype? That's a pretty good prototype. So I'm assuming if I obey each command, I'll actually get the good ending. Let's see. I'm on my way to get me a cookie. How would you even get the Easter egg ending, huh? How could you get... Could I drag the books and put the books in there? I don't know. I'm gonna get me a cookie, though. I'm gonna go back to my room. Get me some experience points. Word of God, I still think this game is for my mother. Because she's having me do chores. But I got a little reward at the beginning. It's when you get the other test. That's when it's a little confusing. That's when I no longer understand the game. I don't know why I'm doing this voice. A lot of the stuff I can drag and drop. I'm, I'm very... I'm very much confused. You are very obedient. Thank you. If a player needs a good weapon, put a kitchen knife into the toy box. Is something gonna come out of my TV now? Why did I make that noise? Is am I planning on taking this with me to fight the evil? Am I planning on going and fight the forces? There's a good place for this knife. Don't forget about it. Why? It is so quiet in here. Music perfectly intensifies the experience. Turn on the radio. Why do I need a knife? Reality is often disappointing. I'm aware. I'm aware. Trust me. As Madara Uchiha said. Wake up to reality. Can I have my knife? Can, can I have my knife? Can I have my posters? Can I have some comic books? Can I get nothing? Can I get nothing? I'm assuming that this was again not the good ending. Wait, do I just disobey completely? Do I go out of my room and come back in? Oh my god, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna- on every task. Every task I'm- I'm just gonna go out of my room. And then walk right back in. I'm just gonna ignore it all. I'm just gonna take in the scenery. Is that an object over there? Is that a person? Am I being watched? I'm just gonna go in my room. I'm gonna take the knife. Take it into my room. Task failed. You're darn tootin' it failed. Put toys into the toy box. I'm gonna bring a toy in here. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take my ball and I'm gonna go into my room. Cause screw you. Without completing your task, you will not level up. I don't wanna level up. Okay, I got more balls under the bed. Turn on the TV. What I'm gonna do is my toy box is gone now. My my toy my train. You stole my train? Are you freaking kidding me? Again, I don't know if this is actually what I what I'm supposed to do. I'm just gonna My toys are all over the floor. Oh, you didn't take it. Okay. I yelled without thinking. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, so apparently doing this is not doing anything. Let me just Sucker, you thought I was gonna do it, but you were wrong. Put a kitchen knife into the toy box. Wait, can I grab the cactus? Oh, come on, I wanted to grab the cactus. You get a book, that's what you get. That's what you get. You get a book. Go read. But then I did not expect from you to be such a noob. It's so quiet. You're darn right it is. Can I turn on the radio and then turn it off? <laughs> it's late, you better get back to bed before I get back. Hey! 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 I hope you were having fun when I was out. Love you, mom. Yes! How do you get the Easter egg? Do you have to run the battery out? 
What if that's the Easter egg is you let the phone die? You reached a good ending! Hey, 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 hey. Let me see if I can... I, I, I am honestly 100% convinced that to get the uh, Easter egg ending, maybe you have to let the phone die. So I'm just going to let that pass. While I play on my own phone. Because my thought process is the game cannot communicate if the percentage is just gone. It's dead, it's finito, it's finished, nada. There's nothing there. So I have a feeling that's the Easter egg because no longer can you get communicated with when there's no percentage. I'm just gonna stand here with my room open. I'm gonna go to the washroom quick. Nothing happened, right? Nothing happened. Oh, we're at 27%. Look at that. Imagine something moved past there, just moving, just imagining the lights flickering out there. It'd be even more scary because there's, the lights are off and it's daylight. I'm just moving through my house. It's not very big. Where does my mother even sleep? I want to ask that question. Why do I have a room and my mother doesn't? What kind of house am I living in? Or maybe this is just a an upper room? Hmm. Because you know sometimes you have like basement suites, maybe this is just like an upper suite, but the whole entire house is owned by my mother and I. But I have the, I have an upper, an upper suite. And she has maybe the bottom. Otherwise, because there's not even a couch, dude. There's no, there's no futon. There's nothing here for my mother. She sleeps on the floor. I'm spoiled. I'm a spoiled child. All right, so before the percentage reaches zero, I have a question. Does anyone else ever just walk around their house when they're there by themselves and just take in the silence? Just take in that calm or just like... <sighs> if you live by yourself, you get that constantly. If you are married, a relationship, if you have kids, and you actually have the house to yourself, I would really have to know, because I do this quite often, actually. When I'm at home by myself, there's no one around. I'm just like, ha ha ha. That's nice. I love that. It's great. These are questions asked by Swift Edge. <laughs> the things I try and do when waiting for timers to go down. Oh, it's a joy. I'm going to make a mess of my room. I'm going to chuck books around something that... Yo, that was freaking sweet. That's something I would never do in real life because um, breaking the spine of a book would just break me. That is still such a good throw. That, wait, that's even better. Holy fudge, it landed on the pillow. 1%, come on, what's going to happen? What happens if the phone reaches zero? Come on, tell me, tell me. Please tell me this is the Easter egg ending. Please? These games, they, they do... They do sap your phone battery a lot. Okay, so now it's at 0%. Nothing? Seriously? Batteries the application will shut down in 8 seconds. I did it. I figured it out. Big brained it. That had to be the ending because the entire... Entire game just closed down. And it went to the actual game page but it went into one of the in-depth files that was that was a good game I like that it was a good prototype I look forward to seeing what the developer does with that I think it'll be a very fun cool maybe even spooky horror game I definitely would love to see maybe some more scares because you know we are being talked to through the phone so maybe every now and then when the door is opening something glitches out or you just see an apparition and then it quickly, again, glitches out. You just see something that adds more to the tension because there wasn't tons of fear on the atmosphere and the tone. But it was fun. I like that. It was a fun experience. If you want to check it out for yourself, link in the description below. I recommend you go and check it out for yourself. Yes, I messed up the word. Shut up. And if you enjoyed this, make sure to smash that like button. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you thought about this game. And if there's a game you'd like to see me play for future videos or series, leave a suggestion down below. Take them all into consideration. And if you're new around here and you've been enjoying all of this, why not hit that subscribe button and click that bell so you can notified on my next video. I will see you on the next one, though. Bye!